Hello everyone, Mike Rempel from Another Set of Eyes with today's Excel Bytes blog post. Today we're going to answer the question, what week number are we in? And here's the scenario that we had. This was actually a question that came to me uh, from an individual who wanted to know, based on the various starting dates of uh, an individual, whether it's an employee at a company or a student in a course, based on their start date, what week number are they currently in? And then a follow-up question is, how can I be alerted when they hit a certain week number? So here's how we're going to solve that problem. So here I have an example of an employee, Tony Jones, and let's assume his start date with our company was on March 2nd of 2014. So how are we going to find out what week number he's in relative to his employment. Well, we can do that with the week number function. And so we're going to say equals week num, and the week number returns the week number in the year. And what we're going to do is take uh, the serial number, and that's going to use the today function. And the today function is just going to identify what day today is, and then we're going to say um, within the week number function, what day do we want to start the week on? In our case, we're going to use the number two, which indicates it starts on a Monday. So that's going to give us the week number of today. So then all we need to do is subtract from that the week number of the start date. And again, we'll go with number two for Monday. And now that tells us um, all we have to do is now format it as general. It assumed it was date because we were dealing with dates, but we really want it to be general. So we'll format it as general, and maybe we'll center it just to pop it in the middle of the cell. And now it tells us that Tony Jones is in his 12th week, basically taking the week number of today and subtracting from that the week number of his starting date. So how do we then find out, or how do I get an alert to tell us when maybe he's hit his 15th week. Well, we can use conditional formatting to do that. So we have the cell highlighted that we want to conditionally format. And on the Home tab in the Style section, we'll choose Conditional Format and New Rule. And we'll use a formula to, to determine which cell to format. And the for uh, formula we're going to use is equals h6 which is the cell that we're in is greater than 14 and then the format will choose maybe we'll make the color of the text white and the fill red say okay so that's what it looked like and we'll say okay so whenever the week number hits 14 that should turn into red now I can't move today forward but let's assume instead that Tony started on January 12th of 2014. That puts us in week 19. And you can see the conditional formatting made cell H6 red to identify that he's exceeded his 14th week or he's in uh, a week greater than week number 14. And there you have it, using the week num function and uh, conditional formatting to solve our problem for today. Hope you liked it. Hope it's useful to you. If you'd like to see more, please feel free to stop by my website, excel-bytes.com, and I hope you subscribe. Happy excelling.